is half of one of Australia's most successful radio and TV duos. But along with comedy, he also dabbles in music, footy, and now he's gracing our screens again as the host of Channel 9's newest game show, The 100. Please welcome Andy. Andy, good morning. How are you doing, mate? Morning, guys. I'm going well. I really bit, well. Big for Ben, because normally we've got two footy players that come in every week, Tom Dude and yep. Ollie Wines from Port, and um, yes. they get branded with the unofficial third member of the team because they have like a yes. weekly segment. I thought that was bold for Ben to, to bring you into the <laughs> fold like that. I mean, we, we speak to you maybe every, I don't know, five months or so. Well, I was thrilled. Obviously, I've, I've put the application in to join the show for many, many years <laughs> now. <laughs> and kept getting... Uh, knocked back. Yeah. Um, they said mainly because of clerical mistakes, but I know it's just probably <laughs> I don't fit. But uh, yeah, nice to be finally welcomed in. Oh, it's so good. Uh, now, look, the world is such a chaotic place at the moment. This mm. year, the, the pandemic has continued to rage. I mean, what Russia invaded Ukraine, uh, yeah. inflation is mm. surging. Just reading through the press release for the upcoming season, uh, you've put to the 100 panel, the pots and pans go in the dishwasher. <laughs> so it's still still tackling the, the big issues on the 100 Oh, absolutely. Um, do you eat the skin of a kiwi fruit? Those type of ones uh, will be will be covered off. People do that, don't they? Because I've never there you understood. Go. So you're that. interested. You're interested. I must admit. <laughs> I must admit. <laughs> you got me. You got me. I'll be tuning in. <laughs> well, have a guess. What percentage of Australians I, eat the skin oh, of a kiwi fruit? Do you think? I would say fifteen percent. It'd have to be the minority. You know what's you crazy? Are in it's, touch with a common man, Liam. It's fourteen percent. It, it, wow. Really? Wow. Yeah. There you go. You know, Do what? you want to see if you can keep this rain going? Yeah, yeah go I'll go give on. you another throw, question. Throw a few more at me. Okay. How many Australians have heard a deathbed confession, have been told a oh, deathbed geez. confession? Oh, okay. Uh, that that's even, that'd even have to be rarer, right? I mean, most people take things to the grave. Really but then you think about everyone's got someone in their life that's sadly passed away, and I think a lot of people would confess things on their more, deathbed. More deaths than kiwi fruits would be say. Mm, I'd, I, you're, you're the master, I'd say I, 20%. Uh, Let's go twenty five percent. Oh, do you reckon one in four people are hearing a deathbed <laughs> confession? <laughs> ben swung me. I mean, have I was you, saying, have you ever heard one? No. <laughs> have, you, have you ever been next to someone who's just passed away? No, yeah, well, I have. I <laughs> it's have. A very they didn't thing to do. Yeah, wow. Yeah. What is it? What's the number? Four oh. percent. Oh, I see. Yeah. Oh. I let Ben. He, he let the did, Ben. Ben me. led you down the wrong path. Yeah. Yeah. I did. Be what? yourself. Nice little little message for yourself. Just yeah. trust your gut. Yeah. Go with your own gut. No, yeah. I was, yeah, but this lady comes off. on tomorrow night's show and she says she worked in palliative care. Mm. So she'd been alongside a lot of people of course. that had passed away. And she said uh, that this, this one guy, they ushered out his family and they said their final well wishes. And then he turned to her and goes, psst, psst. <laughs> now, now that they've gone. <laughs> And got this thing off your, her ch- his chest yeah. that his family would not want to have known. <laughs> oh my god! It's quite remarkable. And do you but find yeah, that, out if we watch? We the do show? Oh, tomorrow good. night. You'll find out. Good. All and, right. And this might be the breaking the fourth wall down a little bit. Mm. But uh, what's next to you right now? I mean, maybe it's a boring answer to your to your left. It looks like sheet music. What is that? Yeah, is that I'd, a boring answer? This? Well, no, I don't know. No, behind, no, that. behind that, the actual this. thing that you put the the board. The, oh, this. Yeah, what is that? You know what? It, this is interesting. So, I'm in. For people who don't know, this is the trickery. I'm not in Adelaide today. Yeah. yeah. Um, but I'm joining you via a remote studio in yep. Melbourne, and this must be the studio where they do all the ad, read all the ads. Oh. I see. Because on this, it's a music stand where people would probably put their notes. Yeah. But on this stand, everyone has stuck their visitor. Badge that Nova oh, prints out. Is right. that what that is? So, who, are so you, is there like some big names yeah. there? Who have we got? Well, there's people that I know, but but, but Diana Glenn's a, a fantastic actress, and she's got stuck her there. Ditch Davy used to be an a, an actor on um, Blue Healers. Yeah, he's obviously still coming in and doing some voiceover work. <laughs> Jason Jason Richardson, who he has been um, commentating on Channel Seven, he's yeah. also commentating the Commonwealth Games at the moment. Yes, his one's there. Uh, I think you're the biggest Chris. name so far, Andy. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon you can probably put yours on John, there. John Deeks, for people, <laughs> real um, multimedia connoisseurs will know that he's yeah. been a voiceover person for about 100 years. Yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, Pia Miranda, the, yeah. the, the, yeah, the, yeah, the, yeah. the star of Looking for Ella Brandy. Wow. She was on there as well. I'm sorry yeah. I asked. <laughs> <laughs> Catch Stewart. 
<laughs> Cat Stewart, great actor. <laughs> uh, yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah okay. Sorry, Russ. Well, yeah. Well, look, uh, uh, Andy Lee joining you this mm. morning on Nova. The 100 is back. Uh, and uh, also, I mean, you, you've been busy at the moment as well, Andy, because we, we saw that um, you've re-released all of the old, like, Hamish and Andy. Mm. So, like, pretty much every show you guys have ever yes. done. And it's yes. all archived and you subscribe to it. How, how's it all been received so far? Yes, so we did uh, with Apple. You can do an Apple uh, mm-hmm. subscription. Subscri- uh, subscription, it's hard mm-hmm. to say. Uh, but, um, yes, yeah, so you can sc- subscribe and see, uh, listen to any show Hamish and I have ever done. And, and, and Hamish goes to me, how's it going? I said, I haven't really looked at the figures yet. But um, people are calling me again. And, and he goes, what do you mean? I said, oh, you remember 2006 we accidentally gave my number out? <laughs> uh, <laughs> That's so, so funny. So my phone has started ringing again with people that have started going back through the show. <laughs> I remember for like, Four or five weeks in 2006 <laughs> when my number came out, uh, that, that happened, and now it's happening all again. So it's nice <laughs> to travel awesome. back 15 years well, in time. Well, this probably answers that question, but I was wondering, was it someone's job to go back through and like listen to everything and just make sure it aged well? Because obviously no, it's a no, long, it's there's, a long there's time ago. so many things that would cancel Hamish and I. <laughs> there are things, I promise you, there are things that I listen back to, because Hamish and I do another po- uh, podcast yeah. called The Remembering Project yeah. where we listen back. And there are things we listen back to and go, nah, we're not, we don't, we're not going to say that in this yeah, day yeah, and age. Yeah, but yeah. yeah, so someone will be able to trawl through and if they really want to, they can get their knives out and, and finish our careers. Well, that's um, it. But we'd appreciate your $2.99 a month to do it. <laughs> I, 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 I have been sucked in. I, I subscribe, $2.99 a month. Oh. And I was driving in this morning. I was like, oh, I might put some old ones on just because, you know, we're going to be speaking to Andy this morning. <laughs> And um, I've got I've got a little oh, no. um, I've got a little excerpt. <laughs> this is just from um, one of it's your shows. Home. It's both of you um, from <laughs> from one of your shows oh, in two thousand and six. Hamish Blake turkey slap by Andy <laughs> live on. I can't believe I'm having a turkey slap on the show. You ready? Oh my yeah. God. <laughs> yes, Hamish has been turkey slapped on the Hamish and Andy show. <laughs> what are we doing? What are we doing? I don't know if you get away with that one these days. <laughs> no, no. See, there's so many things. This is what I can't even remember doing it. I've blocked it out of my mind. But it's quite funny to think. Oh my gosh, that's the thing. That would have been probably because Big Brother. Yeah, the guy got kicked out of Big Brother. You know how radio yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something yeah, happens, yeah, yeah. you're tired, you get on the grind, you're doing something, you come in and go, uh, like, we, <laughs> I think, we, I think, I think Camilla got kicked, uh, sorry, got, uh, one of the guys got kicked out yeah, to, yeah. to slap Camilla in the Big Brother house, which is appalling. And so uh, I guess I did it to home. Well, I think, I think, <laughs> I think, I think the context here that is probably necessary is I think it was a slice of turkey that you used to slap him in the face. That sounds, that sounds about right because <laughs> I, it, 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 every time I've properly turkey slapped him, it's a different thing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. There'll be none of that on The 100. You can check it out with Andy Lee. Returns tomorrow night after the block on 9. Andy Lee, I'm thank you very you much. i said that, Liam, because I'm sitting there going, I really can't remember doing that. <laughs> <laughs>